A bombshell new photograph has been released in the sex trafficking trial of Ghislaine Maxwell. The picture shows the former socialite cozying up to the convicted pedophile Jeffrey Epstein at the Queen's log cabin on her Balmoral estate. The couple are said to have been there at the invitation of Prince Andrew, just highlighting how close their relationship with the royal was. For more, we're joined by Sunrise Royal Editor Rob Jobson. He's in London. Morning. How would the Queen be feeling about these pictures? Well, this entire mess just goes on and on. But to see, to see that the, the paedophile Jeffrey Epstein and Ghislaine Maxwell at that lodge, which is so personal to her, where she used to just escape with her friends um, and ladies and wade in and just enjoy the, the Scottish hideaway is just embarrassing and um, really upsetting, I would think, for the Queen. I mean, that is such a special place for her job, as you're saying. The Duke has vehemently denied a close friendship with Jeffrey Epstein, which you have to question when you see photos like this. And Ghislaine's family says that her and Epstein weren't very close either. What, your view on that and what do these photos actually show? Well, that, that's why these photographs have been produced in, in court, is to show the closeness of the relationship. I mean, they, it look, they look pretty cosy there as a couple. I mean, that's what people were claiming, that during that long friendship they, they had a, an intimacy and an intimate relationship. Look, it's it's uh, the fact that Andrew's now denying that he had a close friendship. You know, who does he invite to uh, his his mother's sort of hallowed places? The fact is, uh, he must have had a pretty close relationship and friendship with both of those people to invite them to Balmoral. You don't just invite, um, you know, acquaintances there. Do you think we'll hear anything from the palace over this? It, it seems like mm. it's a pretty serious one. No, they're leaving everything, really, Nat, to the, the lawyers and his team of lawyers uh, when dealing with anything to do with the Epstein case. It's so murky, it's so potentially dangerous for the monarchy that um, I think that uh, they, they very much are leaving all those things to, the, uh, to Andrew's team. The reality is he's supposed to be coming out a little bit more firmer about this. He's supposed to be sort of very much strongly denying um, relations with these girls, but also the closeness of his relationship with Epstein. I think it's a bit, long, a bit late for that. I mean, you know, he has admitted on television that he had a friendship with him and, re and used to regularly stay at his properties. So I think that mm. it's a bit late, late for that yeah. tact.